Hello everyone, welcome back to UChat YouTube channel. Today we are going to talk about the inbound webhook uh, add-on. Okay, this is a feature that if you need more inbound webhooks, and you can uh, in this video I will show you how to purchase it, how to activate, and how to test if you reach the limits or not. Okay. So uh, let's get started. So first of the uh, question is, if you do not know what inbound webhook is, and I will show you, okay? So if you go to any of the channels we support, you go to the tools, go to the inbound webhooks, and here you can actually create the inbound webhook, okay? So the inbound webhook will allow you to send the information to the UChat platform, okay? And then you can match up the phone numbers or emails. If we cannot find the contact, we will create the contact. And you can save, uh, you can send extra data into UChat and all those data will be saved into the user custom fields. And then you can trigger the flow, the automations. Okay, this is extremely popular if you are using phone number based. Uh, for example, WhatsApp, SMS or the voice and uh, it will be you know very smoothly connect with the party with the party platforms okay you do not need zapier or public connect or make to do that okay so this is the native feature that is built in already now let's talk about the uh, limits we are offering okay first of all we offer 500 requests per 24 hours okay those are free for every user okay every um every bot i would say okay so you can see here that is the rate limits okay 500 requests to use within 24 hours okay and um, if you need extra um inbound webhooks and then i will show you how to you know what our price and how to get this activity so first of all, the add-on price, as you already know, first of all, this is this add-on is at the bot level. Okay, it's not at the workspace level. That means if you have a particular bot, uh, this add-on will only increase the limits for that particular bot. Okay. Second, we already offer five hundred requests per day. This is already uh, offered for free. Okay, that is fifteen k request per month. And this is the add-ons you can purchase for extra limits. So that is uh, 1,000 request per day. That is in total, okay? Uh, if you pay uh, $20 per month, that will be 30K request per month. And if you uh, if you buy two 20s add-ons, that will be 40, and the request will be 2,000 request per day. That will be 60K request per month, okay? So this is the add-ons we have and you go through that and uh, um, purchase the add-ons that fit your needs, okay? Now, this is the price, and now I will show you how to pay, okay? So first of all, we will need a flow in S. Uh, so maybe this is a little technical, but I will show you where you can get this, and you need to, um, and also there's these payment links that will be shared and the video descriptions, okay? So you need to go to this checkout link and then select how many add-ons you want to purchase and put the flow in S when you subscribe, okay? So let me show you how to get your flow in S first. So if you go to your um, workspace, for example, I can go to my workspace and then I go to all bots, okay? This will show all the bots I have. So you just go to any of the bots you want to increase the limits, click the drop down, copy the flow in S. So this is the flow in S that we will need. Okay. Um, also, you can send us the workspace name, uh, workspace ID, or your chatbot name. Uh, we can find that for you. Okay. So both works. And now, uh, if you click this checkout link, and it will bring you to this checkout page. And uh, you can see, uh, this is uh, uh, we will need your workspace ID. We will need your flowing S. Okay, so I already show you how to get the flowing S. 
And now let me show you how to get your workspace ID. So your workspace ID is go to workspace settings. Okay. And here, this is your workspace ID. So you just need to paste your workspace ID here, paste your flow NS here. And here, this is the variable. Okay. So if you only need 1000 requests per 24 hours, you purchase one. Okay. If you need 2000 requests per 24 hours, you can increase the add-ons. Okay. We will ad adjust this limits according to what the plans you subscribed. Okay. So after you subscribe, what's the next step? After you subscribe, you need to how this is how to activate. Okay. So uh, you need to send especially this payment receipt and uh, your flow NS okay, to our support email. And we will activate this within one business day. Okay. In the future, if you are not using this anymore, you need to reach out to the support to cancel. Okay. And also we need your uh, emails that you subscribed and also we need the flow NS. Okay. So that is how you can activate and also how you to cancel the add-ons if you are not using it. Now, the last part is, uh, the, uh, the last part is how to know if you have reached the limits or not. Okay. So let me go to uh, my workspace over here and it's very simple. Okay. You can, you can, you can know it exactly. Uh, very easy and very fast. Okay, so let me show you a quick example. So you go to your tools, inbound webhooks, copy a webhook URL. Okay, and then you go to the flows. You can create a very simple, you can just use uh, an external request inside of our platform. Okay. And then you can paste your inbound webhook over here and select the post and then click test. Okay. It will send a data back to your inbound webhook. And if you click here, response header, and then you will see all the limits informations in here. Okay. You can see this is the limits my bot is currently have. This is the remaining. Okay. This is 498 limits remaining. So if we activate the limits for your chatbot and you will able to see the limits that is matching the add-ons you purchased. Okay. And also you will know, uh, and also that you will know, okay, why this, um, you know, why my bot is not, uh, it's not triggering. Okay. Sometimes it's because you reach the inbound web, inbound webbook request the limits and then the request just the drop off. Okay. It doesn't trigger anything. So that will create issues for you. So it's better. You have a very, very clear idea how many request limits you need and always purchase a little extra just in case that, uh, you know, for certain days, the request just go up. Okay. So that is all the content we are having today that uh, introduce the add-ons for the inbound webhooks. If, you need any extra inbound webhooks request, you can follow this video um, to purchase the add-ons to your needs, send us the receipt, and uh, also you will able to test how many um, you know request limits you are, um, that is remaining on your current limits, okay? So uh, that's the video for the day. See you guys next time, bye.